so these first pictures you're seeing are just of the experiment that I flew and then you can actually see Joanne um, playing with them. Um, and then this table is actually full of our outreach items. We got to take on some extra items that we could use in the classroom to show our kids. Um, and then this is actually a picture of the real Vomit Comet. This is the original plane that they used to do zero-g flights on. But now it's memorialized. It's like standing on top of a little hill. But this is the plane that we flew on. It's called the G-Force 1. And if you look inside, that's all the seats there are. It's the very back of the plane, just a couple row of seats. The rest of the plane is completely empty, and we were filling it up with um, our experiments that we were flying. We were right, actually, pretty darn close to the seats. There's um, two teams from NASA that were like NASA engineers testing stuff for the space station that were right next to us. So that's kind of cool. Uh, this is our flight team. This is all the teachers, and the guy in the red is Jamie. He was our mentor from NASA. Then. You see me in the flight suit. That was, I was very excited to actually get to put on a flight suit. And so I kind of got carried away with taking some pictures. Um, and then these next few pictures are actually from the NASA photographers that were flying on the plane with us. Um, they took a picture of us right before we started our arrival as we flew up to the normal plane height. And then they're like, hey, take a picture while you're getting your experiment ready. And then we actually started our parabolas after that. Um, this picture of me is actually the very first picture that they took when we started our parabolas. And this is like, literally like, we just got into microgravity and I just popped up and I was so super amped. They told us at the time, you know, you won't know whether you're supposed to scream because you're freaking out or if you're supposed to laugh. And I did, I kind of made like a funny, ah, kind of noise. It was weird, but it was amazing. Um, and then this is me flying with my, I made a little CD hovercraft. Um, and then I brought Harry Potter with me. Those two my outreach items. And then this is our whole group of people that flew with us um, on my flight day. And then this is a really cool picture. The NASA photographer actually, um, he moved the padding aside on the emergency exit window and took a picture of what it looked like outside. So when we were on our way up, that's what the view was on our way up. And you can kind of tell it's like really dark because we are so high up. And then this picture is us on the way down. So this is during the microgravity. And it's kind of crazy. You're like, oh, no, they're tilting the camera. No, the photographer is, like, staying, like, at the perfect angle that you would normally look at at a window. So, um, these next few pictures are just ones that I took from stills from our video that we recorded of us doing our experiment. You can kind of tell I was having fun floating around doing that. Um, and then I'm going to show you two little videos real quick. The first one is just... Um, from our video that we took, and you can kind of see me being stupid. I was lifting my arms up, doing the weights, um, and then Allison next to me kind of started trying to. The guy in the back does not have a shirt on. It is okay. He was doing stuff for NASA. He was doing a heart rate thing, um, and you see us actually working our experiment, and then the next one is actually the NASA videographer's video of us, and it was the first parabolas, and it was like the first three or four parabolas, and he just videotaped everyone, and you can kind of hear everyone freak out and go, whoa! This is kind of cool, but here are some videos for you.
Thank you. 